I was at a yard sale recently and I stumbled upon an old graphing calculator for pretty cheap. This works? Uh, oh, yeah. yeah. It does? Okay. Yeah. Could you do 10 on it? Would you do 10? I'll do 10. Okay. That'd be awesome. Just for you. I appreciate it. Funny <laughs> enough, the TI-84 calculator was one of the first handhelds that I ever witnessed modded to play games. This blew my mind back in the 10th grade watching a kid play Mario on one of these. So today we're going to try to get some Pokemon running on this thing in that kid's honor. Obviously, the first thing that we need to do is very respectfully and legally rip the ROM of the Pokemon Red cartridge that I own onto my PC. Next, we're going to download an application called TI Boy. This is the software that can convert the Game Boy ROMs into an app that can run on the calculator. Once it's done, you just need to drop that new file onto the calc using the TI Connect application. I went ahead and did Pokemon Blue too, uh, legally. Once the long transfer is done, we can access the games from the apps button. And it's really as easy as that. I like how you technically don't need to modify the calculator at all. Just convert the ROMs over and drop them on. I really wish I would have known about this back in high school, but honestly, it was probably a good thing that I didn't. The game does have some noticeable slowdown, but it does play and save as normal. And if you get the even newer version, which is the CE model, the processor is twice as fast and can apparently handle Game Boy Color games too. I am definitely going to be on the lookout for one of those. Let me know in the comments, would you fail math class for this? 